feel pretty. <laughs> the devil is a lie. Yes, it is. Hey, that's my type of friend. That's my <laughs> hey, y'all. It is Saturday, almost 7 o'clock p.m. And your girl's in the house finna get dressed and go out and have a good time to celebrate one of my good good friends birthday her birthday is on monday december 18th so we're going out tonight to celebrate she invited me to a what is it an ugly christmas sweater party i'm not wearing no christmas sweater but i am going to wear a sweater i think at least that's what i have out we'll see when i put the outfit on see how i like it but yeah y'all i haven't been on this camera since thursday because friday i was out with my mom for a few hours running some errands with her and when i got home it was probably around like five o'clock and i went to sleep because i did work last night and that's why i'm so tired i went to work overnight when i got off at 7 45 this morning i went straight to my honey house and went to sleep there but she woke me up around 12 30 i didn't go to sleep till about 10 this morning she woke me up around 12 30 and i've been woke ever since so i'm tired y'all <laughs> i don't mean to be complaining but a sister is tired and um i'm about to get dressed so i'll see y'all in the next clip when i go to do my nails y'all know i like to wear my press ons so that when it's time for me to do hair or if i gotta go to work you know, the long nails won't be in the way or slowing me down. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing tonight. Doing my hair while well, dipping my ends. See, this is how it came out when I first dipped on when I got finished braiding it. They still look all shaggy. But this is how I like them to be nice and straight. And they'll look better when they dry. But I'll see you all then. Let me finish doing this and I'll show y'all my cute little nails that I'm finna put on. Y'all just finished dipping the ends of my hair and I figured I would make me a little drink because the the Christmas sweater party, which is also a karaoke party. I don't know if I mentioned that when I just told y'all it was a Christmas sweater party, but it's a karaoke party and it's also BYOB. They will be in there selling food and selling the hookah, but um, I'm going to eat something before I leave the house and I'm about to make me a drink now because I don't have a full bottle to take there and I'm not going to the liquor store. Yeah, I don't usually keep bottles in the house. I don't drink like how I used to. I only drink on occasion. So I have this tiny bit. I have this tiny bit of tequila left in here from Thanksgiving. I told my sister to put the bottle in the trash and she said, girl, that still was shot. You could drink that. So I said, I'll take it home and I'll drink it when I'm ready. So I'm going to use that little bit. And then I have this bottle of tequila, this classy azul that I had for my birthday for a couple years now. It's a little bit left in here. So we're going to see if I can make me a drink before i leave why well, i am gonna make me a drink before i leave i don't have any orange juice here but i'm gonna use that tequila and mix it with this grenadine and i'm gonna stop at the store and get me some orange juice so i can make my tequila sunsets one of my favorite drinks i'm gonna make that and put it in this cup and take it with me i may as well pour my liquor in here right now while we on video Let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna drink this tonight. And I'll save that little shot for 
whenever I have company, somebody can drink that. But I'm gonna pour this and this in here. And I'm gonna go to the store and grab me an orange juice. And voila, magic. Oh, just stay. And I think that's more than enough. They had me feeling right all night. <laughs> I might get on the uh, mic tonight. Sing y'all song or rap y'all a little something, something. <laughs> I'm gonna wait till I'm about to leave the portics in there. But I'm going upstairs, y'all, to do my nails. And I'll see y'all in the upper room. <laughs> Alright y'all, so I'm finna brush my little edges and do my nails. We done made it to the upper room. And I don't know about this outfit. I like it, but I don't know if I'm really feeling it when I look in the mirror. But we're gonna see. I'm gonna put some jewelry on and see if the outfit comes together see how we like it after that Yo, I'm really considering not wearing my glasses tonight because I got these heart-shaped glasses that I want to wear so bad just because they're cute and I haven't worn them in a couple years. I don't know why they just popped in my head, but I was thinking I wanted to put those on. If I'm going to put gold jewelry on, I think I'm going to put those glasses on. So, I'll be cute tonight, but... I won't be able to see, <laughs> and that's fine. My girls ain't gonna stare me wrong. I think I'm alright to be blind while I'm with them. You see my little edges? I be trying to do them up. I let me put some jewelry on. Let's see. Maybe we can wear these gold little numbers. I don't know where I got that tonight from, but it's been in my head. Somebody used to say that some years ago. Somebody used to say it all the time. They used to be like, tonight. And I don't know if it was one of my friends or if I got that off of TV. But it's so funny. And every time I say tonight, I say it like that. That is so corny. <laughs> it's funny, but it's corny. Two more or one more? Child, I don't even need to be playing all these necklaces like this. I think those three is fine. Yeah, what you think? What you think? 
Let me know if these three, if these three look good to y'all. Or should I just wear one? Or should I just wear two? Let me know. Let me get these nails together. And then find my heart glasses to see if I'm wearing right them. Y'all yeah, got these little Van Cleef, Van Cleef, the dupe. The dip dips, I got them from Shein. And they are so cute. They are so cute, y'all. But the gold is fading already. And then I got a lighter pink one. So maybe the dark pink and a light pink. I have this green one. A white one. And a purple. Yo, they are so pretty. They're like my favorite bracelets right now. So I'm going to put a couple of these on. And then I'll get to my hair. I mean, not my hair, y'all. My nails. I'll get to my nails. Y'all, let me know how y'all like my braids. Because I am loving them, y'all. When I say I'm feeling these braids, I usually do, though. Every time I do my own braids, I feel them. Like... Like, when I say I be feeling them, I be in love with them. Soon as I get done. Not even as soon as I get done. When I'm doing them, I just keep lifting them up. I keep lifting them up, looking in the mirror, put them in a ponytail, checking them out. Because I'm really in love with <clears throat> my own braids. Like, when somebody else do my hair, I have to get used to it. It's taking a couple of days for me to be like, oh, yes, I love my hair. But when I do it myself, I be loving it. So I don't even know why I ever even spend my money to pay somebody else to do it. You know what? I do know why. Because I'm lazy. Why well, I ain't going to say I'm lazy. I'll be tired. I'll be working. I'll be busy. So every now and then, I do want somebody else to do my hair. <laughs> I do. I ain't going to lie. I'm going to put this purple one on. I want to show y'all these new balances that I um, picked my outfit out around these sneakers for tonight because I wanted to wear them. My honey got me them, and I did wear them a couple times, but I ain't, like, go nowhere. Let me show y'all real quick. Yo, I love these sneakers. They so cute. And my honey knew I would love them too. I wasn't even with her. She was at the sneaker store sending me pictures. She sent me these, a picture of some hot pink Air Force Ones and another pair of pink sneakers. And I did like all of them, but these ones I was in love with. I told her, I said, oh, I need those. They got my size. <laughs> and she brought them home for me because she loved me. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to wear this today. I'm going to wear this Marc Jacob Perfect. This is one of my favorite fragrances. And have been for the past two years now. So that's that. Let me get my nails out. Um... I'm trying to see y'all. I don't know if I want to wear these ones. And I wore them already. Yes. They have been worn already. So I don't know if I want to wear these or this set that I got. This pink set. They got some. They got these cute little designs on there. And little stones. They're real cute. But we'll see. I'm going to sit here and lay the nails out. 
Let me get my glue. Hold on. So right now, these nails that I have in this pack, since I didn't put them on a stick like this, I don't know which nail goes to what fingers. So what I'm doing right now is sitting here and sizing them up and I'm gonna lay them out. And then I'll show you guys. And y'all comment down below which set y'all like better. Let me know if y'all like the pink flame set or the pink, the lighter pink set with the cute little, I don't know what to call this design. It's crazy because when I was younger, when I was a teenager, when I used to go to the nail salon and get my nails done, I would get like a pink and white and I would have them mix it up like this. Or I would do like a gray and pink and it was so cute. So when I seen this style on TikTok, I what straight screenshot it and sent it to my nail girl that makes my personal press-ons and asked her if she could do it for me. And she did. She's so decent, y'all. She can usually do any set that I sent to her. She usually get it done for me with no problem. And they are a bit expensive. They're not like the... Those little cheap nails that you just buy from the hair store. It's like really acrylic on there. They're really thick. They feel it it feel and look like you really went to the nail shop and got your nails done. When she make these press ons for me, so and I've been wearing them for years. I just feel like they're so convenient. That's why I do it. What y'all think? I feel like they're convenient. It's worth the money because let's say you go and get your nails done. Sit down in a salon. Sit in somebody's chair, get your nails done. You pay them $70 to make you a nice set. Nice designs. Nice full set with some cute designs. They only going to last on your nails for two weeks. Three weeks tops. And then it's time for a refill. Now when I pay for these press-ons, sometimes I have them up to a year, depending on how much I wear them. If I don't wear them out, I can have them for up to a year. Now if I wear them, like the set, the two sets that I got in June for my birthday, I wore them out. When I say I wore them all summer, I loved both of them. They was both, I actually got three sets on my birthday i paid for two and she gave me a set for free and two of them i absolutely loved i wore them out all summer <laughs> i just was like rotating like whatever i got dressed to go do something i would put one set on and if i let's say i didn't really do probably want to do my nails for the next two weeks or so within the next two weeks i'll put on the other set and i wore those pretty much all summer that I don't even have them no more, but I'm going to try and find them so I can insert pictures of them so y'all can see them. Let me show y'all how I got these separated. Alright, y'all don't mind my little desk. It was actually my nephew's. When he was younger, he got a big one now, so I just took this from him. I had it for a couple years. I don't really use it. Like, when I'm on my computer, I sit in my bed and be on a computer like that. But this is the set. This is one set. And then, this is another set. So, y'all let me know which ones y'all like. Yeah. I think I'll put this one on. I think I'm going to do this one. This is one of my favorites, too. I wore these a lot. These ones look kind of dingy, but they really not. They look like that because the, the base that she used is like a nude. These ones, this set here is like a... 
when I ask her to do to make my nails, I always say they're milky white. It's like a cloudy white, and that's like a a nude. So that's that's why they look so different. One of them is like a nude tan nude color, and then one is the milky white. So I call it. But let's put these nails on y'all. So I'm gonna try and put the camera down so y'all can see how I do my nails because I don't do nothing fancy. I don't have no type of techniques. I literally just put the glue on and stick them on my nails. So I'm going to show y'all how I do them. And I think I did do my nails for y'all on camera before. But it was a couple years ago. So I'm using the same method. Probably just a different glue. This is the Kiss Glue that I got either from the hair store or Family Dollar. Sounds empty. This one is LA Colors Glue. And I know for sure I got this from the hair store. Let me see. Oh, they both sound empty. Oh, this one, this kiss one got a little bit in there. So, let me put the camera down so y'all can see what I'm doing. Okay, y'all. So, this is the best lighting that I have. And I'm still... So undecisive. I think I'm gonna do this. No, I'm gonna do these. I'm gonna do these. No. Alright, I'm gonna do these. Alright, I'm gonna do these. I'm gonna hit these up. I've been wearing these. I've been wearing this set since October. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on. You see, see that old glue and my ripped off nails in there and my nails still look good. I just put a little bit of glue and go ahead and stick that bad girl on. Hold it on for a minute. Give it a little pressure. Give it some pressure. Because, baby. And. Voila. Magic. Mm-hmm. Y'all don't mind my sweaty hands. They always sweat. If y'all know me, this one is new. Because I had lost it. And that's another good thing about my girl. When I get my press-ons made, if I lose one or break one, I just hit her up and pay a couple dollars to get a new one for my set. If I feel like that set still looks good and I still want to wear it, oh, I'm going to get me a nail made. If it's one or two. Now, if it's three, four, I might as well just get a whole new set made. And then I just push them down. Like, push them the opposite way just to make sure it's tight there. To make sure this part ain't lifting at the bottom. And they both want good. Okay. So, I usually do three on my left hand. Then I go and do the three on my right hand. And then I come back to do my pointer and my thumb on the left hand then I go over to finish off with my right uh my right pointer and thumb mm. 
Okay. All right, y'all, I'll be back. I'll show y'all when I get finished. Y'all, yeah, I'm back and my nails are done. They look so good. I got one of them on crooked, but that's okay. That happens sometimes. Once I noticed it was crooked, it was already dry. This one right here. You can really tell from this way. But looking at it this way, you can't really tell that it's crooked. So those are the weekend nails. Y'all let me know down below how y'all like them. I'm going to put a cute ring on. That's from my Instagram boutique. Follow me on Instagram if y'all not. Sassy Tings 101. I'm going to put it across the screen here. And then I'm going to put on my cute little watch that I got from Macy's a couple years ago. What is it? Olivia Burton. So stinking cute. We're going to wear this tonight. And no, y'all, don't work. I need to get a new battery put in there. But that's fine that it don't work. So let me show y'all the outfit. I don't know what pocketbook I'm going to wear because I've been wearing this silver one. I've been wearing this silver bag for a week now. And it's not going to go with these gold accessories. So we need to change that. Maybe I'll put a pink one on. I don't really have a pink one to match this outfit. But that's fine. Pink is pink. And I think I'm going to go with this. Cute number. My cute little Kurt Geiger. Let me see. Let me look in the mirror and see how I like this. With this fit. Yeah, I like this with the fit. I feel like, you know, the gold chains ain't the same color gold, but I feel like it looks really cute. The earrings are chain detailed. The chains here, and then the chain on this bag. So I'm gonna wear this. I'm gonna go out in the hallway to the mirror to show y'all the full outfit. All right, y'all. So this is the fit for tonight with the new balances. You can barely see them. You see the toes but that's cool and I'm feeling it I feel comfortable I think I need to eat a little something before I go out though so I'm gonna go downstairs and warm up some food and I'll see y'all either at karaoke or when I meet up with Micah I'll see y'all soon. Yo, I'm back. <laughs> I didn't eat nothing yet, but I wanted to come and put some, what is it called? A little bronzer. I wanted to put some bronzer on my face before I head out. Yo, I never had, like, my makeup done before. I never had a full face of makeup. Like every now and then I'll do my mascara and my eyeliner. But I never had a full face of makeup done. And somebody told me I need to grow up. <laughs> they told me to stop being childish. And I don't think that's me being childish because I love the makeup. The girlies look so cute with it. But I don't see me doing it because I know that if I was to do it, I would absolutely love it. Because I love my face. Like I love my face, period. So I feel like... If I get the makeup done to enhance this beauty, I would totally love it and it would be another bill for me. I feel like every time I get dressed to go to an event or go somewhere, I would want to get my makeup done. 
and I'm not about to start spending all my money on it. So I'm going to keep my coins, <laughs> my little coins, the little coins that I do have. I'm going to keep those and we'll figure out the makeup thing later on down the line. I kept saying um, that I was going to start watching some tutorials to start doing my own makeup or at least try to learn how to do it. But I ain't bought no makeup yet. I ain't watched no tutorials yet. But I probably will. Maybe that could be a video for y'all. Y'all watch me do my makeup for the first time. But I... Where's the bronzer? I got some bronzer, y'all. And it's so old. I had it for years. But it still works. So I'm going to use it. This is it. I got another one right here that I got from my sister. She bought me this. She bought me this before I even got this. I had this for probably over 10 years. I just thought it was so pretty. I just like to sit it on my dresser in my little dressing room. Every time she see it. Well, she ain't said it in a few years. But every time she would see it, she would be like, You still want to use that? You still want to use that bronzer I bought you? And I'm like, girl, it's so cute. I don't want to use it. I'm going to have it forever. But this is the one that I do use whenever I do. It just opens like this. And it got a little brush on the inside. Got a little mirror. So I just take the brush and do a little... One, two, three. Little swipe, 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 swipe. And then I go like this. I go like this. Let me do the chair. And then <laughs> the whole face is bronze. It'll be cute. Especially in the light. I'm going to go in the bathroom and get a light so y'all can see what it looked like. Because I ain't putting that ring light back on. I didn't already move it. I'll put my little lip gloss on when I'm done eating. I'm going to make my friend a little gift bag with some accessories from my jewelry line let me see i don't know if i have any pocketbook you know what? i'm not gonna give her a pocketbook because i gave her a pocketbook last year so i'm gonna see what i can find for her last year i got her a pocketbook i actually gave her this pocketbook from my accessory boutique the same purse in the same color i gave her and she said she liked it she really liked it I don't know if I ever seen her wear it, but this is the one she got. Then I got her some cute, um, this cute little makeup holder thing that holds like, it holds like cotton balls, Q-tips, and stuff like that. All right, y'all. So I'm down here and to get my girl birthday gift together. And then I guess I'm heading out the house because she just called. So I'm guessing she's ready, but I missed her call. And then when I called her, she didn't answer either. So let's start off with this. Cute little notebook for her. Just a regular notebook with the lines in there. With a cute pen. I thought this was really cute and I know she would love it. And then I'm going to put these perfume samples in there. This Viva La Juicy and this DKNY. I am also going to put in her bag some jewelry from my Instagram boutique. I am Go In For Mica. We have the silver heart pendant with the rope chain also from my boutique 
Sassy Teens 101. I'm going to put it down below so y'all can see it. And then this is just a bling ring. I hope it fits her. But this is it. It's really cute. So I'm going to give her this as well. I'll put them all together in one box. And then I have this rainbow happy birthday. Then I also had this heart bag. Which one am I use? I think I'm gonna use this heart one. Okay. This. Oh, I didn't show you the pocketbook. I got a pocketbook for her as well. That's from my Instagram boutique. Let me show y'all this. It's so cute. And it do come with a long strap. It's in here somewhere. Nails. So here's the long strap to it. It's a cute black chain strap. So I'll put that back. Put this in my bag. For my girl. Mm. Let me see if I didn't open it and close it. That's easy. All right, so I'm going to put it back in this little sack. For now. Put it in here. Those. That. The tissue paper and we good to go Alright, y'all. We ready. I'll see y'all later. Oh, I'm getting stuck to the sweater already. I can't even leave the door. Alright, y'all. Maybe I'll see if she would like to open her ears on camera for y'all. If not, I'll just let y'all know if she liked them or not. But I'm sure she'll love them. I'll see y'all when we get to karaoke. Y'all, these are the heart glasses I was telling y'all about. And they're so stinking cute, but I can't wear them because I can't see nothing. I just had them on around the house for like 15 minutes and my vision is getting so blurry. So I'm not going to wear them. They're so cute. I wear these glasses since 2019, I think. But I'm going to wear my prescription glasses. They are similar. They're just not heart shaped, but they are the clear glasses with the gold frames. Yeah. I just talked to Micah and she's not ready. Of course, like always. My girl going to stay late. If there's one thing she going to do, she going to be late. Talking about she'll be here by 9. But we'll see.
now she's saying she'll be here by she she was originally supposed to be here by nine but now she's saying she'll be here by 10 15 but we'll see so these are my glasses little pink for the ear part gold around the lenses yeah i feel pretty <laughs> so I guess I'll sit here and edit a little bit until she called me and tell me she's out front. I'll see y'all in a little bit. Uh. Happy birthday, beautiful! Twenty-one years old. I heard that. <laughs> Those many tears I cry does not mean that butterfly must take a chance and spread my wings. Love can make you do some crazy things. Oh, yeah. To take care of me. And I turn around and you're standing here. Hey y'all, so this is the birthday girl, and you know, she loved her birthday you. gifts. I know, <laughs> I, I started to, you but it was too much going on. I can't. can't. This. No, she already opened them. Girl, bye. I'm, <laughs> <gonna pretend. laughs> She's not gonna pretend. I'm so serious. See, that's my type of friend. That's <laughs> my girl. She's gonna pretend for me. <laughs> but y'all, we just leaving karaoke, and we had so much fun. You had fun? Yes, I did. I had we a good did. Time. I I wish I probably would have got there on time, but I don't know because you know we don't like being where alone. Yeah, so it was nice though. Yeah, it was like when we got there, some people was leaving. We got there late, but it was, it was nice. Great. Yeah, we had so much fun. Do a crowd. We gotta go again. Do they only do it in Chester? I don't know. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Ah. 
She got a birthday date tomorrow. <laughs> it should be cute. <laughs> and he better be me. Because I'm glad they didn't say I was real strong, but I wasn't. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So I'm back home from the karaoke night, and it was so much fun. My friend did get on the mic and she had a good time. So I'm going to put a little couple clips in here of her on the mic singing with my other friend. So shout out to y'all. Both of them has been my friends since I was a kid. And I love both of these girls dearly. Micah and Shahara. Y'all will see them more on the channel sometime. Hopefully soon. But y'all, when I say I had so much fun tonight, I never been to a karaoke um like a public karaoke event no matter of fact i have at a bar but it was some years ago but um even at the bar even with me going to a karaoke night at the bar it was never as much fun as it was tonight but i'm about to go to sleep y'all y'all have a good night thanks for tuning into this video i'm not sure if i'm going to vlog tomorrow tomorrow but thanks for watching i really appreciate y'all and Stay tuned because your girl going to be recording. Comment down below what type of videos y'all want to see. I do plan on doing some sit downs with a couple of my girls. And we're going to see how that goes. Good night.